Dating with children. When you have children, when the other person has children. My name is Amy Botwinick with WomenMovingOn.com, and this is for Divorce360.com. I'm in a great relationship after many years of divorce with a man who has four kids, and I have two. We're like the new-aged Brady Bunch. But the reason it works is because his kids are much older and mine are younger, so my kids, you know, look up to them like they're amazing, and his kids look up to down to my kids like how cute. If it was six kids all together at the same age, I promise you I would probably run for the hills. So realize when you're dating somebody with children, it can be challenging and it can be wonderful. And I don't like, you know, like that kid, okay, it's, it's baggage, but it could be really good stuff baggage. But you have to know really what, what you're getting yourself into because it's complicated. And you're really marrying into a whole situation. And there are going to be issues with kids. Kids always have issues. Little kids, little problems. Big kids, big problems. But when you combine them both, it can be really challenging. And that's one of the hardest things with new relationships post-divorce is being able to deal with a kid issue. So, you know, when you start and you're getting out there and you're dating with children, make sure that you connect with your partner about boundaries. You know, the person who is a parent is a parent. There's no overlap. The other person should just be like an aunt or an uncle, not disciplinarian. And, you know, you have to have the same... Not exactly the same parenting styles, but the same type of values for your kids. Otherwise, you're going to clash. I'm not going to say run. I'm just going to say know what you're getting yourself into. Because relationships are hard enough. When you're going to add kids into the mix, it can be really complicated. But it can be controlled chaos in a good way. So, my name is Amy Botwinick with WomenMovingOn.com, and this is for Divorce360.com.